It's a moment this Kharkiv resident will never forget. At 5 a.m. on Thursday, a Russian missile struck this apartment complex. Hours later, residents are packing up what they can salvage and seeking shelter elsewhere. The only thing this woman was able to save was her medication. With this bombardment, the entrance to my apartment caught fire. And on the first floor, there's a teenager who died. He was just 16 years old. The apartment complex is located near a military airport. The attack has angered those living there. They destroyed everything. Is this a military target? He should know he has blood on his hands. He won't be able to wash it out. On the highway heading into the center of the city, many Ukrainian troops are on the move. Most appear to be heading north towards the Russian border. In Kharkiv, the streets are nearly deserted. Many of the city's residents have taken refuge in the metro. Children can be seen lying on makeshift mattresses while the sick are helped by their relatives. The metro has been turned into a bomb shelter. I heard explosions. And we also live in a neighborhood where there was fighting this morning. Outside, people lined up to withdraw cash from the ATMs, while on the highway, long queues formed to buy gas. Meanwhile, back in the metro, a long wait is just beginning.